For our wall squat, we're gonna start by being about 12-ish inches away from the wall. We can get further away if you have not so great ankles. Elbows are locked out. We're gonna get down to a good deep squat. So hands are gonna stay against the wall. Elbows stay locked out. Feet stay in contact with the floor. Squat down as deep as we can and stand back up. If that was easy, we're gonna walk about an inch forward, okay? Again, the compensation here is the elbows to bend, back to round forward, and then once you get down here, if you're really tight, a lot of athletes are gonna kind of lose their stability and step away from the wall. So you'll be able to tell here, this is a great drill and, and if, for you to just figure out where the tight link is on your body. A lot of athletes will feel it upper body or upper shoulders, they'll feel it mid back, low back. You could even feel it down there in your calves, your knee, your ankles. This is a great self-assessment tool for you to be able to get a, a, next to a wall and evaluate where our, our tight spot is on our body and then we'll, we'll go in from there that's the area that we'll address moving forward. So walk in just a little bit further, coach. Push a little bit, see what we got. Ah, so that's probably his breaking point right there. So that's where he needs to stay. So that's our, this is our wall squat. 